today I'm going to put some focus onto the third line of Spy Time Rag. And what's difficult about this is we've got an A sharp, so the high third finger on the E string, which looks like this. And I'm using this violin with the marks again, so you can see exactly how I'm using my fingers. So that's A sharp. And then after the A sharp, so this is in bar eight, we've got a B natural, and that will go on top of A sharp, so it's a semitone away. What we then have in bar 11, we have a B flat and an A natural. And what we need to understand is that B flat is A sharp. So what I need to do is I need to put my fourth finger, that B flat, on the same spot that I just had the high third. So here is A sharp stretched up close to the fourth finger mark there, you can see. And then when I use the B flat in the next bar, it's actually in exactly the same spot. So they're the same note. So this is a really tricky thing to understand and people are finding it pretty difficult to get this bar right. So I'm gonna do it. A natural, so just normal third finger. Fourth finger, B natural, it's far away. E. Now A sharp, far away from the two. B natural on top. Now what happens, my third and fourth both move back. So the third finger you'll see is in the third finger, on the third finger mark. So I'll do it again. Time a little faster. 